Yes, lads. Can everyone hear me all right? Sweet, 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 sweet. <laughs> just give me one sec. Cool. Apologies, just managing all of the kids and a wife on half turn. So um, it's just a bit fucking mental. Um, thanks for adjusting. Um, so we will meet uh, normally Mondays at 11.45, all right? It's only just because we had a family day out yesterday um, that we couldn't do it. So thank you for adjusting. And obviously I know that some of the lads will watch back. Not everyone can make it today. So first and foremost, um, welcome to the next phase. Um, the next phase is really about diving into um, a little bit deeper in terms of you, in terms of processes, in terms of structures, um, in terms of the journey. Um, and I've just finished talking to uh, uh, another group that's week six of the Elite 19. We're just going through processes with those guys as well. So there are a couple of key things that I <clears throat> almost want you to consider over this journey. Now, I think some of you have signed up for three months, some of you signed up for six months. So maybe this is either a three month or a six month, or it might be fucking for the next two years. You know, you might end up becoming a, a long-term member. But whatever happens, there's a couple of key things that I want you to put in your head. And I, if you've got a pen, I would write these down just so that you can bullet point these. The first and foremost, first and foremost, the first thing that I want you to make sure that you do is not fucking beat yourself up over this process, okay? It, it, the, the biggest downfall to lads and women, men and women, moving forwards with themselves is that they beat themselves up, okay? And it's because um, of your chimp mentality, okay? It's because of the expectations that you set. Each and every one of you right here now will have some element of expectation of where you think you're going to be in three months, six months, one year, whatever it might be. And quite um, quite a lot of the time, that expectation comes from that chimp mind. Okay, so this is where I'm going to be. It's going to be this rigid. I'm going to make sure I achieve this. I'm going to like. And reality is, when we do, when we when we create expectations like a chimp, we don't take into consideration all of the family, all of the human brain, all of the reality of life. So, like a like a chimp process might be that. Do you know what in um, in 12 weeks, I'm going to lose four stone. But what ends up happening over that time is that maybe you become a male and can't train for two weeks, okay? And, and then you can't eat properly or you're shitting and vomiting all over the place or that actually one of your partner becomes ill and you can't train as much or something happens. So the natural process, the way that your brain works in terms of like you create this tune timeline and now that you're not on it, okay, you then start beating yourselves up on those expectations. The only expectations that you set yourself over these next 12 to these 12 weeks to 24 weeks and beyond um, is to grow and show up 1% a day. Like people think I just fucking generally say that. This, you're on a journey. So the journey wants to progress moving forward, right? Without putting too much pressure on yourself, without having a perfect mentality, without thinking that you're going to solve all of your problems in those in, in that amount of time you are going to come up against hardship there is going to be things in your life that are curveballs there is going to be shit to eat <laughs> you're going to get punched in the face something is going to happen and like mike tyson said you can have the best plan in the world to get punched in the face all right so first and foremost i don't want you to beat yourself up and then think that you're doing shit and then start so fucking feeling sorry for yourself because it changes the attitude, okay? Life isn't fair, life will never be fair. Hardship will never disappear. And we're gonna have to make sure that we focus more on the controlling aspects. How do I manage? How do I control? How do I adjust my thinking, the way that I react, the way that I show up, even with all of these things going on, okay? And we can't do that if we feel sorry for ourselves. Can't do that if you're beating yourselves up all the time. So you have to have a real open mindset really open mindset into how you approach right number two you must create a set srs structure routine and system for when you are going to attack the modules you're going to find there's a lot more content to get through okay than there was in the elite 28 for this week example um it's about the morning routine so this week, you're going to focus on the morning routine in a little bit more detail, right? But you have to make sure that you know when you're going to watch those videos. 
And just because you watch them right there doesn't mean you have to action them immediately. So it's kind of like watch. Maybe watch again. Maybe um, absorb, reflect, think, and then kind of go into that plan. If you don't make that process, if you don't go through that, what ends up happening, it's like a filing cabinet. All of the videos start piling up, pull, 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 pull. And then we get to week three and you haven't even watched weeks one. And then we straight away go into that mindset. Oh my God, I've got this weight lifted here, like all these expectations. And then, and then we lose you. Okay. So it's really important that we set clear times uh, and places when you're going to watch these videos. Okay. Like I say to you all of the time, and I know it, fucking bit of a joker but like every time you go to the toilet you can sit there right you're there for 10 minutes there's no videos that are much more than 10 minutes you just sit there and watch it and then you can next time you watch it you can watch it and make notes okay number three if at any point if at any point if at any point of time you feel like my god i just feel like i just need to unlock everything's going on in my head like i'm like Fucking everything's overweighing you. All right. You must reach out in the app to me, John, like Simon or Mike, to someone just going, I just need some clarity on one situation or I'm just stuck on this or I've got this thing here. Because what I always get is that, oh, I just don't want to bother you. I know you're busy. <laughs> like, I'm busy serving you. Like, my job is you. Like, do you know what I mean? So, like, reach out and know that. All the time that you're with us, you've got four guys who have been through it all, who, who have got the whole process in their head, know exactly what's going through. We've worked with hundreds and thousands of, not hundreds of thousands, thousands of guys, gone through all of their issues and their problems. So it's going to take maybe one message just to snap you out of that fucking mindset. Does that make sense to everyone? Um, the next one in terms of the live videos. Okay, they're 11.45. Please do not stress yourselves if you can't make them. Okay, if there's something that you want me to cover, just drop me a message. Okay, just drop me a message and say, can you cover this in the next one for me? And I'll have no problem in doing that. You can watch them back. It would usually take around 48 hours before we put them back in the WhatsApp group. All right, so in the WhatsApp group, just same as the Elite 28 Day, we'll make sure that that goes up. Does that make sense? Cool. And I think that's really just in terms of the initial briefing, guys, of what we want, of what we want. Um, if that, anything doesn't make sense, if, if if there's any time that you need clarity, if you need that support, um, make sure you reach out. Make sure you put your SRS for when you're going to do watch your modules, watch your videos. Make sure you print out the street sheet that I put in the WhatsApp group this morning and the app. OK, so that's going to help you. Make sure if you haven't seen that, go to topics. Um, update from JB in the app. Okay, so that's the last post I put. So make sure you print that out. And make sure you give it your all. Like, this this is like that moment where you've gone, right, yeah, I'm in. Like, I'm in on me. Like, this is what it's about. And one of the guys on the last call, he was going through all of his reflections. He was over planning. He was stressing himself out. And he said the one big win for him, and this is the one for me that gave me goosebumps and kind of made me realise that he's fucking made it in some respects. He phoned his wife after having the sandwiches that she bought, she made him, and she went, they're so good, I, and I just wanted to really show my appreciation for how much that I loved her and how much she'd done for me. And I phoned up and thanked her for the sausage, uh, sausage sandwiches, whatever sandwiches it was. But it was a moment of gratitude, and he says... I've always undervalued my relationship and I haven't valued it to the point where I want to phone up and I want her to know that the fucking sandwiches that she made me were amazing and that I really appreciate her. And she had never been in that, like, that he had never been in that place because he'd been too foggy. He'd been trying to fucking work out his life. He'd been too stressed. But he was so clear-minded on what was important that he said, it's just brought us closer together more than anything, more than anything. And that's what we're trying to do here, right? We're trying to create that bigger picture to make sure relationships are solid. Do you know what I mean? Making sure that we appreciate the people around us. We appreciate what they do for us. We appreciate the life that we have. And over that journey, I want you to remember that all of the time. You know, you, you, you guys coming through, like, are, are, are like the future of the brotherhood in terms of moving forwards, right? You know, the way that we are training you guys, the way that we are building you up, the mindsets that we're trying to create, 
it's not always what we try to focus on at the very start I've been with us in, in, in past years but this is what it's trying to be it's trying to be that better husband it's trying to be that better father it's trying to be that better man and you must make sure you drop the ego and really just present yourself as your true human self so that you can be happy man you know I'm looking at all the grimaces on the sc screen we've got a fucking lot of work to do miserable fuckers <laughs> <clears throat> so um <clears throat> from next week it will become more i i will always do my piece in terms of educational stuff so we will base it on weekly theme um next week we will talk about the morning routine based on all of the videos that you've watched and then we will be able to crack straight on and at the end of the week that you've been learning we'll be able to do a little bit of talk on it you'll have to you'll have an open forum so I'm like I'm going to open now in terms of uh, if, if there's any questions on the subject or anything that you've learned you'll share within the group you'll learn from each other that's what we're here for all right so is there any questions does anyone want to bring anything up at this point cool all right so if you get chance um can you please do that testimonial for me for the Elite 28? Okay, thank you to those that have done it. Obviously, if you haven't done it by next Monday, I'm gonna fucking call you out. <laughs> Look at yeah. oh, sorry, I wasn't in the call. Um, so what we just, I just literally need, I put, uh, I did put one up in the WhatsApp group, but John's actually cleared out the WhatsApp group a lot quicker than I thought he was gonna. So I'm just gonna put an example I put up there. I think Greg, Greg, you did me one, didn't you? Greg Clements, yeah, it was, it was great. It was perfect. So I'll put it up in there <clears throat> and I'll just put the format of what it is. It's literally a minute and a half. Just like I'm not looking for fucking Steven Spielberg attempts. Just literally put your camera up and just say what you got from the program, right? Just looking for real guys just to show, show the true self. So um, I think that's it for now. So this week, you're going to get all your modules in your brand new piece, your brand new personal group, Elite 90 group, that's on, on the app. Has anyone not seen those yet? So everyone's everyone's already checked in, everyone's in that group, everyone's where they should be. Cool, man, we're fucking doing something right. Brilliant, finally, after four years. Um, any dramas, then just let me know, guys. Happy? We'll see you next Monday, 11.45, ready to get tucked in. And smile. Fuck, I want more smiling. Like, fuck. Right. See you guys.